Uh, welcome back to Ocarina of Goon Time. And that's it. That's the one. <laughs> uh, in today's episode, we're gonna go blow up some rocks. How about that? Yeah. A little speedrun strat. <laughs> oh, sorry. We just ate Popeyes. This epic fast travel. Can't go wrong with Popeyes. They sprinkle crack in those apple pies. Dude, Popeyes, if you haven't done yourself the service of getting yourself a Popeyes apple pie, cinnamon apple pie, whew, do it. Best fucking thing I've ever tasted. If they want to spot, we will. <laughs> Dude, I would, I would take a Popeye sponsorship. <laughs> I would only take like fast food related <laughs> sponsorships. <laughs> Ooh, I think look at Pop these guys. I think Popeyes is top of the list for Who's me. Who she look like? She looks like some kind of like cartoon mom, but I can't. Like the mom from uh, Danny Phantom, kind of. Uh, I guess this one, this woman has like a longer hair. Remember, she's wears like the blue spandex. She usually has like goggles on. Sometimes she doesn't. Oh my god! Look at this nightmare over here. These people are horrifying. Can I get a zoom? Whoa. Alright, we gotta head back to uh, Hyrule Castle real quick. For a little Hydrule secret Castle. Secret. Little secret secrets. <clears throat> this is like one of those things I always fucking forget about in my mm -hmm. playthroughs. Oh man. I said the F word. I don't know if we, uh... How many seconds it's been. <laughs> Fun? Yeah. Put that... Edit that over, what I said. Because apparently you can't swear in like the first eight seconds or something. Alright, little we're, hole. We're way beyond. Well, I don't know why I'm like. Woo! Another great fairy fountain! I like throw accents on words now. I don't know why. Uh, I don't know why. It's your Delco. No. <laughs> no. Oh, Not from Delco. C stick. There we go. Nice. Yes, sir. Yes, <clears throat> sir. Yeah, yeah, sir, right. that's right. Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> oh, oh, I bet. Oh, I did that Ooh, already. Ooh, she's in the sexy pose. They even, like, gave them, like, little beauty marks. On. They 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 knew what they were doing. <laughs> oh, yeah. They yeah. knew what they were doing. Look at those fucking four polygon titties. <laughs> Welcome, Scrungus. And this is a child's game. She's gonna give us a magic spell. I forget how many great fairies there are in this game. I want to say there's six? I could be wrong, though. I think I'm right. Ooh! So this is, like, it. it this is a required Din's item. Fire. Yeah, this is Din's Fire. It's really cool. I'll show it off later. Um, We're not going to need it for a while, but I always forget to grab it. And, like... I, you have to as a child. Okay. You can only get it as Kid Link. Alrighty. So, so there's no, like, going back once you're adult Link. Uh, maybe, maybe not, man. Who knows? Okay. Fuck, I saw it. There we go. I saw the sign. I cut the sign. I sliced it and I diced it up inside. Nice. You like that? Yeah. Pretty good. Thanks, man. I'm doing like a Weird Al thing. <laughs> Everything goes back to Weird Al. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, well, here, I'll, I'll show you. It can. Boing, boing, boing. That tells me the time. The in game time. But, uh, if, if you do the mask side quest, which is really lame, the, like, item you get for it is the Mask of Truth, and these little stones will, uh, tell you secrets if you talk to them while wearing the Mask of Truth. But it's like, it's not worth it. It's, oh, my God. They don't like that I was just there. Alright, I have to make it daytime so the fucking gate's down. So I can leave! Stupid old castle town! Thank you! Goodbye! Alright, what did we just get? We got the Din's Fire. Mm-hmm. Uh, what else did I say we had to do? Or was that it? I think that's it. You said that's a very important thing. But we won't need it now. Right. Okay. Well, I guess we can head over to Zora's Domain. Remember Zora's Domain from Breath of the Wild? Oh, yeah. Beautiful place, Shark right? Man. Very beautiful place. Fish Man. 
Oh, wait till you see the Zoras in this game. They're not fishmen, are they? Or they're weird looking fishmen. <laughs> oh, they're fishmen. I don't know what designs I like more between- I, there's more variety in the Breath of the Wild designs, but... I just like the designs of, uh... This game's- same with the Gorons. The Gorons don't really change much. Okay. A magic jar. <clears throat> That's how we refill our magic. <laughs> Pulled a bomb out for a second. <laughs> a foolish samurai warrior wielding a shape shifting master of darkness. Is wielding there... a magic sword. I feel like there's a little secret here. Wielding right. a foolish samurai warrior. I was wrong. Wielding a magic sword. This is the bean guy. <laughs> Jimmy, I'm eating beans. Oh, oh Jimmy's Dude, I'm just, I'm just playing. I'm just having fun, man. I'm just playing. Man. Yeah, that's what it's all about. <laughs> Getting some sculptures. Oh, we Woo! have to jump here, as the dirt path would indicate. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. That's what I like to do. Oh god, hold on. That's what it's all about. Now that we're not in danger of burning our shield. This is an Octorok. Okay. Oh, I remember those pain in the asses. In this game, they only jump out of the water. They look absolutely horrifying in this, this game. Purple, um, yellow, glowy eyes. That, that's a terrifying sight. I mean, they're just more, like, squid-like, I guess. But, like, the real kind of squids. The really disturbing kind. <laughs> In Breath of the Wild, they look like, uh, Squidward when he got his head bashed in too many times. <laughs> oh, the, the one where he, like, becomes baby Squidward? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he, yeah. That's, that episode's absolutely trash. <laughs> There's one where, um, <coughs> there's like a new one, I saw like a clip of it online where Spongebob goes to the gym with Larry and gets like super huge. I really want to watch it, like that's such a funny premise for, <laughs> for modern times. Um, this is also another shortcut to the Lost Woods that we don't flip and need. Guess what we do here? Oh wait, you see that? The heart container? I think I have to get it after this next dungeon. Is that where you get double jump? Yeah, you unlock the fucking double jump in a Zelda game, yeah. Nice. Very nice. We get Ravioli's Galori, or whatever. <laughs> get Rav... Chef Boyardee's Gale, or whatever. <laughs> Chef Boyardee's The bird guy nuts. from Breath of the Wild? <laughs> Rivali, that's his name. Rivali, Rivali, give me the formula. All right, this is Zora's domain. Yo, Zora! Still has the banger music track. I like this. You do? Mm-hmm. I, I thought you were gonna, like, shit on it, but yeah. I mean, yeah. I like the water texture on the uh, walls and everything. See, doesn't this water look good now? Like, kind of yeah. good? Yeah, it's pretty good. You convince yourself that this is, like, kind of good? Yeah. I mean, I'm not, like, I never, I don't, I didn't shit on, I never shit on the graphics, I just said, like... You said the water didn't look good in this game. Did I not? Yeah, in the first episode. Uh, well, We were in the Great Deku Tree, though. I think. So, I mean, it's water inside of a tree, however good that can look. Well, I don't think it looks terrible, I just think it shows its, its age. Which yeah. isn't a bad thing. No, yeah, it does. It does. Uh, we gotta go see King Zora right quick. I can appreciate. Whoa. There he is. He's a sloth man. That's King Zora, dude. He's a fish. Oh, my dear sweet Princess Rudo. Where has she gone? I'm so worried. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. You well, are sitting on her. He's clearly uh, not sitting willing to talk. Her. This is this. I I would always come here just to do this when I was a kid. 
Talk to this guy, right? Diving game. Want to play 20 rupees? Sure. Okay. <sighs> so he's going to chuck all these blue rupees into the water. Bloop. And uh, we get to dive in. Woo! Oh, yeah. That's so satisfying. Nice. I would just climb up there and jump off the waterfall as a child. Because I ne never knew where to go. <laughs> me on... Me playing Kingdom Hearts 1 at like age 8. Dude, uh, I don't know where to go. Dude, this looks better than Kingdom Hearts 1. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Hmm. Probably more fun though. Uh, yeah. Easily. You are right about that. Definitely more fun than Rechain of Memories. Thank God we're off that. Yeah, like, you don't know the release. <laughs> I am released of that game. <laughs> I'm baptized like Link rolling through this water. I feel like I'm reborn. <laughs> what a graceful dive. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what a camera wow. angle. I like it. This is a scale. Nice. We got the silver scale! Aww. Okay, cool. Let's go get our third bottle now. Woo! I love how the water is teal, but like, that filter was was blue. So, the silver scale lets us dive further. So we can get into here. And there should be- there's the bottle. Hey! Look at this! And we got it. You got an empty bottle. <clears throat> There's something in it, though. Oh, gee, I wonder what it is. This is Lake Hylia, by the way. Really, Link? You have to sweat. You can literally, your feet are touching the ground. Lake Hylia. Yeah. Um, empty bottle. If there's something in it, Whoa. doesn't that mean it's. Where did this guy come from? Not empty? I'm Azura. Have you seen anything strange in the lake? The river carries many things into this lake. They don't, they don't look like fish. They look like aliens. Uh, yeah, I guess. Well, fish do look like aliens. Well, that's that's true. Have you seen the blobfish? Uh, put, up, put up a picture of the blobfish. Cool. I'll look at that later. <laughs> it's like this fish. It's like a super deep sea fish. And whenever people bring it up to... Uh, you know, towards the surface, it like its bones become jelly from all the like pressure from being so deep sea. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, and then it looks like a big fucking sad blob. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine it has like a big nose, and it's just like yeah. Mm -hmm. It does, it looks like Squidward if he's like pink and melting. Alrighty, uh, bottle. You would think if it's in the deep ocean, like, it would be more structurally sound when it reaches land because of the pressure. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Hmm, let's see, she's inside Lord Jabu Jabu. Uh, oh, yeah, so the note, we grabbed that bottle and there was a note inside from his daughter, Princess Ruda. R Ruda or Ruda? Ru? Not Ru. I think it's Ruda? Rudo? Ruda. Ruda Bega. Ruda sounds right. Not Ruda, yeah. Hmm, let's <laughs> see, she's inside... Jabu Jabu, that's not possible. Our guardian, our, our, our guardian Lord Jabu, I don't know what voice I did for him. Lord Jabu Jabu would never eat the, my dear Princess Rudo. Oh, it is Rudo. But since that stranger Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear, of course. We'll go find Rudo. You can pass through here to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. I'll keep this letter, you can keep the bottle, yada yeah, yada. Yeah. Alright, now this is the iconic 10 minute cutscene. Is he take- he's gonna- is he scooting over to take a shit? Yep. Why would they do this? <laughs> Why the fuck would they do this? You know the answer, man. <laughs> the bit where to, they wait- To fuck with you. <laughs> to waste yeah, everybody's to waste time? Them, <laughs> I wasn't joking. Oh my god. It's <laughs> a 10 minute cutscene. Editor, leave all that in. Thank you. Oops. Playing a song too. Um, I don't think there's anything else to do here right now. So. The devs are assholes. Oh, that. actually, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. We have to get fish. 
So let's go fishing, dude. Fish in a bottle, baby. Let's I thought go. Just gonna eat it. We have to give Lord Jabu Joey a, a oh, we gotta sacrifice. Feed him. Oh, <laughs> fuck Joey. Yeah, something like that, man. <laughs> Something like that. Find my little princess and feed me. <laughs> my, he ate my little princess. <laughs> How am I gonna talk to her on Discord? <laughs> There's no internet inside our Lord Jabu Jabu. <laughs> oh my queen. Alrighty, there he is. <laughs> That's Whoa. Lord Jabu Jabu. It's a big boy. He's literally just like a fish. He doesn't like talk or nothing. <laughs> He's like stupid. And they just, they, just, they worship him as a deity. D D D D King D D D. He just um, opens his mouth and he just points at it, and that's all the dialogue you get. Welp. Am I spot on? This, this is like another thing that's cryptic. cryptic. I, I I only know to do this, but yeah, you have to feed him a fish. So here we go. Have a little fish, big guy. Hmm? Uh oh. Is he giving the suck? He's giving the suck. Oh. Yep. So our next dungeon is being bored. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's Kingdom Hearts all over again. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? I told fuck? you. I, this is what I was referencing. Oh it said it was Jabu Jabu, man. This whole level's in the way- this is some Jabu Jabu shit. Monstro's just Jabu Jabu. <laughs> they ripped this off. Um... So I guess we'll- how are we doing on time? Do you want me to check? Yeah. <laughs> oh god, he's running. Uh, we're at 20, 21 minutes. Oh shit. Well, uh... Let's go into this next room and call it an episode. Okay. And, uh, yeah, this is the grossest dungeon, so... Get ready Ew. for that. Alright, thanks for, uh... Hold on. Oh, God. Uh, thanks for watching! <laughs> <laughs> here, here. What a segue. You know what? We'll end the episode this way. Here's Din's fire. Oh, yeah? Whoa! The Kamehameha! Call me my mama. <laughs> the All Ten right. Commandments. <laughs> that was a uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs>